What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to get advanced and more complete word count status for your WordPress posts, pages or custom post types, okay? So in today, yesterday's video we did learn how to get the WordPress, how to check the WordPress word count status, okay? But this method, it's a quite limited, okay? So you can see the amount of words, simple as this. However, in the case that you are looking for a more complete way to review your data and have statistics and so you can analyze the content, how you are going, you may need a plugin. And into this video, we're gonna learn how to use this plugin as well. So before anything, please hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it means for us, okay? So let's go to the guide. First of all, move to our WordPress dashboard and once on dashboard, we're gonna direct to the left side of menus and search for plugins, add new. Into the upper right corner, we're gonna type the word count, okay? And let's WordPress search for plugins and this is the guide that we're looking for, okay? The WP word counter. This is one of the most used plugins, okay, for this thing and it's well done for free and works great, okay? So we're gonna be installing this one, click on the install button. After this, we're gonna click on activate. It's gonna redirect you to the plugins list page of your WordPress dashboard. Here we go. Let's review where is the plugin. Here is the plugin, okay? You can upgrade to pro version in the case that you want, but we're gonna keep all for free to this guide. As you can see, a new button did appear on our WordPress dashboard left side of menus and is the word count. And we have right here the statistics, the reading time, the calculate and the upgrade to pro button. Let's start with statistics, okay? You need to calculate your word counts before you can start using the plugin. So let's click on calculate. Count all the content on the site at one time. Count content by date range. Okay, so you can click right here so you can count the content by date. You can filter the content by date or you can click right here, select this option to calculate all the content. I want to calculate all the content of this site. So click on the button, calculate word counts. It's gonna take a moment so, your, so the plugin can start counting. Word counts calculated successfully. Visit the statistics page to view. Before this, just let me sh explain you that the amount of time that it takes to calculate the content of the site changes according to the amount of content that you have. If you have a blog with thousands of posts, for example, with lots of products, with lots of contents on page, it may take a while. No need to worry. Just wait, okay? But once it's calculated successfully, let's click on statistics page. And this is where the fun begins. As you can see, we have one hour and four minutes of reading time. We have 15,000 words, okay? Almost 16 total words. We have the, we have almost 40,000 published words and we have 2,000 unpublished words, okay? So this is where all can count. We have this amount of pages, okay? This amount of posts, templates, projects, that is a custom post type present on all the Visual Moto WordPress teams. We have products, contact forms, global styles and variations, okay? Same right here, we have published and unpublished. As you can see, now you have all of the information on your site. They list by top content, for example, in home. The reading time is three minutes. It's a page and it's published and by the, this one, okay? 
and the amount of words, okay? So you can list all the content right here so you can review how long your pages are, how many time it takes to see. You can click into another tab, for example, all contents, so you can review more data. Monthly, okay? So we can filter by month. The outer statistics, there's only a single outer, okay? But if you have multiple authors, it may help you a lot. So you can understand who is publishing more, who is publishing less, okay? The reading time. Normally, we used to read this amount of words per minute, okay? So this is a statistic, okay? This is a general setting, but you can edit in the case that you want, okay? insert before post content we can insert the the reading time in the case that you want let's save change and review this and we have two minutes but why it's only two because we did not type it anything like here okay so before label save chains and review the results we got this is an extra option that the plugin adds however no need to worry in the case that you don't want just unselect this we have the calculate option that we already have made before and we have the upgrade to pro okay so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. In the case that you want to learn more about WordPress, SEO, marketing and sales, please go to visualmoto.com and review the Visual Moto blog, okay? Because we bring daily tutorials, like on our YouTube, we bring daily videos for every single part of website creation and many more topics. In addition, in the case that you are in need of an amazing free WordPress team and an awesome free WordPress plugin, go to wordpress.org or go to visualmoto.com and download our completely free Anzu WordPress team and borderless WordPress plugin. And in the case that you want to start with a pre-made website with all the options, images, content and layouts, to save you time, go to the pro version of the Enzo WordPress team so you can enjoy, save time and have one or more of those amazing sites displayed right here, okay? So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best!